No, you didn't burn your toast. That's the smell of Nuke London still smoking in the background. We are at Flumbly Stadium, of course, home of the Nuke London Hatriots. This town has a lot of history. You got some of the founding fathers of pro wrestling here. Yeah, Slam Adams for one. Man, he had a wicked neck crunching pile driver move. Remember, in the MFL, we encourage you to play with your food. He's probably lining up against you. The New York Threats take on the New London Patriots. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Yeah. <laughs> It's game day here on the MFL Network, and we are just about to get underway. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. Any thoughts on today's game? Uh, uh, hmm. uh, no, nope, not really. Kind of flatliner right now in the thoughts department. Uh, hey, can you help me get this pencil out of my ear? It's stuck worse than it was the last time. Yeah, you idiot. And it's first and ten. Not much there. Maybe a yard. Second down and nine. Oh, and the defender cut off that pet. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Is that right, Tim? That penalty makes no sense. And it's something ain't kosher here, and I'm not talking about the corned beef with extra mayo. And it's first and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. Yeah. And it's first and ten. You saw a saw you never saw. See, there's the saw there. I see. That's right. What you talking about? And it's first and ten. for excessive celebration. You know, refs really don't want to get too close to the rabid, roided-out monsters. And don't even get me started on the werewolves. <laughs> well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. And they stack the line and he gets his bell rung for a yard. Second down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Third down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two. Couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. 
And he put all of his foot into that one. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. And it's first and ten. And he just slipped away like a nice pickup for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. First and ten. And the quarterback. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Second down in a lot. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And the defense gets the quarterback for a sack. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> They caught the defense napping. And it looks like the offense is desperate for a first down. And the defense fight the offensive water with Strawberry Fields. And now they can... And that's another turnover for the defense. With the brain scrambler. And the ref just called a bullshit penalty. <laughs> and it's first and ten. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Kaboom! And the quarterback unleashes us, and he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot, 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 hot. Oh, and he laterals at the last second. And he was 
Grim's running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Hot one, hot two, hot... Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinner. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. The teams are all tied up at the end of quarter one. We'll be right back. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, what a throw. That was a good throw. And assuming he was aiming for the ground. Second down and ten. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. Yo, seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? The players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. It's a time warp dirty trick. The last play is a race. How did they do that? Did they go 88 miles per hour? Just asking. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. <laughs> and 
And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. He runs it for three. Third down and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So is that cheerleader. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can say that, Grim. And it's first and ten. Defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Second down and ten. Oh, devastating hit! You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. She's the Mary Margaret of our ladies of holy hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. That he did, Bricks. That he did. Any field goals over 40 yards are difficult. He's going to really have to boom this one. Wow, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it. I will have a silver. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. the way a Republican congressman hits the airport. And whoever said never hit a man when he's down is just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. here or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room the kick is good as expected those are pretty much just gimmies when you give up points you need to get them back here comes the kickoff let's see if they can make them pay oh nice hit And 
and it's first and ten. It's two yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. Oh, the defender almost picked up the ball on that one. Third down and eight. Stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. Nice punt. Should move them back nicely. And he's got a chance for a good return here. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet oh man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Oh, uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with the uh, no mustard? And it's first and ten. Well, that was a good throw. Yeah, if he was aiming for the ground. Second down and ten. Well, that's a real buzz kill. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. And they take their first time out. Well, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out during halftime. Third down and six. Freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. Does the QB know which team he's on? Oh, man, talk about running into a buzzsaw, Bricks. Okay, he just ran into a buzzsaw. And it's first and ten. Looks like the beat. Get your motor running. It's chainsaw time. <laughs> They're gaining on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. I got a saw buck running on this asshole. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. And it's first and ten. They quickly call a timeout, hoping to save some time for their offense. Second down in a very lot. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go. Boom. And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. 
And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. The teams line up for the kickoff to start the second half. These guys will have to play a lot harder to make it a game. Well, either that or kill and cheat more. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. Well, that play didn't work. He'll have to rethink that. Second down and ten. <laughs> Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And that'll bring up second and one. If you don't hear it coming, it'll knock you right on your ass. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. Touchdown! And he rips off a game Shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. Well, I turned out the line, it wasn't a fact, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. Oh, great play! He is on that receiver like glue. You know, when I was little, my dad used to make me eat glue. My tongue would get stuck to the roof of my mouth, and I couldn't talk. Your father was a very smart man, Bricks. Very smart. Sandwich. Third down, and the punter is warming up. They don't need much here. Looks like they're going for it. Hey, uh, Bricks, check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. And 
and it's first and ten. Defense had enough with this rep and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. First and ten. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback, oh, with the brain scrambler. First and ten. And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like that man, rip out your tongue, he won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. Second down and five. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your aunt. Oh, mama. Just call him Captain Crunch. Another one bites the dust. You're and it's first and ten. He's on, oh, and he just made a nice cut to avoid the saw, but the saw just made a better, cleaner cut to the ball carrier. running back no rest for the weary the last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die and it's first and ten now the offense is getting kills this is really a violent game guys oh that was totally uncalled for and that's why we love the MFL the offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! First and two. Great throw! Great catch! And then put six points on the board! The defense could do anything to stop a throw that good, Grim! You mean aside from driving the ref, kill the quarterback, or actually playing some D? Don't 
try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. Whenever a player gets big like this, it reminds me of that Tom Hanks movie. <laughs> He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. And how about a little dirt sandwich? The offense lost their final running back. Lucky for them, they're on defense now. They're lucky to have survived so much bad luck, carnage, and death, Grim. First down and six. Catches it for a touchdown! What a beautiful play! Yeah, it's all those power that bring like a high cool. They want more points, so they're going for two. No one was going to stop him. That's two points. Hey, man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you dudes out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pal? Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Well. The kicker just ended up in the meat wagon. They'll need to find another player on their bench who can kick field goals. Good luck with that. And it's first and ten. to the races. The coach isn't liking that call. Oh, oh, his head just exploded. <laughs> and this is a first and long. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. First down and forever. First and ten. Uh, 
And if you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Oh, the strawberry field's dirty trick. As my mentor Hunter used to say, I don't advocate drug it with another pick to keep it. Oh, talk about a guy's career blowing up. Okay, that guy's career just blew up. Along oh, with most of his skill. Mm, he was being rhetorical, you moron. You don't think I don't know what rhetorical is, man? Huh? Right down. So please tell me. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. Second down and ten. Whoa! It's like a bloodmobile crashing into a slaughterhouse. First down and five. you pay the secondary for you pay him for the pick six for this you just give him a pat on the head and tell him they don't suck oh great throw great catch and then put six points on the board the defense can do anything to stop a thrown at good man you mean aside from bribing the ref killing the quarterback or actually playing some D Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called... It's good! <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. The ref that just called that penalty, he was convicted of marrying old ladies and stealing their savings. Yeah, that sounds like a good job. He's right at home here, taking money from coaches, players, and fans. I even saw him swipe the money from the bathroom attendant. Yeah, who don't do that? And it's first and ten. up nine yards on that catch. <laughs> and that'll bring up second and one. 
Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Oh, uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with the uh, no mustard? because the defense called a time warp dirty trick and transport their offense back in time. It's just a jump to the left. And a step to the right. He broke free and has open field in front of him. You know, if you go frame by frame, you can see the cover of my son's death metal album. Yeah, baby. Fell up the horns. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. Yeah, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. The defender says, I don't think so. Second down and ten. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. It sounds like my off-season. <laughs> and it's first and ten. He is rolling thunder and pouring pain. It's a zap attack. And the defense gets it. And he finds open space. He's running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you shut of a bitch. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Second and three. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Third down and three. Quarterback passes for a touchdown.
Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. point but you never know with kickers <laughs> straight through the uprights they're looking for a good return after giving up points let's see how they do yeah let's see if they always suck off that was just a one-time thing First and ten. Caught for the first down. And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. And it's first and ten. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Second down and ten. <laughs> At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. Yeah, probably evident. Boom, dead and down. He just, ouch. Anyone in the mood for a steak tartare? And the defense is on his heels. The 10. He did it. He scores. And with that amazing run, he bursts through the end zone for six. Mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. We 
When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. And that's another turnover for the... Oh, and that's what you call a killer one-hitter, folks. I did a killer one-hitter once at an ungrateful undead riot fest. I woke up with three guys gnawing on my kneecap. Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. The Patriots go down in defeat. Next time, maybe they'll practice a little harder and cheat a little more. Forget idiots. This is the NFL. You're supposed to cheat. Won't that be a lesson to them? Let's go over to the MVP. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...